And those relief efforts are already underway tonight as one Harris County woman is working to find a new home after the tornado leveled her house. But she's not dealing with all of this alone. 11 Alive's Joe Ripley shows us how her neighbors are getting her through this. I got five dogs. I had three horses and a donkey. And nowhere to put them. A tornado leveled Sandy Knight's home over the weekend. I was right here on the floor. Outside, the tornado snapped trees, upended her new horse trailer, and took one of her horse's lives. Knight believes protection from above saved her life. All my family's up there. Um, so they was watching over me. Mother Nature is just relentless, and she hits wherever she wants to, and the damage that's left behind just... It's sad. Um, so each pan holds 10 foot long loaves. Yeah, Ann Hammond owns Breaking daily, Bread. If not two pans. A restaurant uh, where Knight works. She says dozens of neighbors right helped there. clean up and Hammond's oh, family is now raising money for Knight. I would encourage people to volunteer to help your neighbor clean up. Again, there are people in Mississippi where these storms started that lost their lives. Donate blood, give things you can if you've got extra. This is the room where me and the babies were. Knight says she's rented this home for over a decade, and while the owner sorts out insurance claims, Knight says she's ready for a new day, and she's not afraid to start over. But this here is scary. It just makes you stronger. With her house now a total loss, Knight says she's going to stay with a friend for however long it takes for her to get back on her feet. Thankfully, though, she says she is alive, and her community is there to support her. In Pine Mountain, Joe Ripley, 11 Alive News.